Every day I get up rushing my school believing to discover one of my people's world. Because I know there are different characters and different worlds. I have been working in a secondary school as an English language teacher for 15 years. During these 15 years I have discovered different kinds of characters, different abilities and I try to motivate them to learn to find their right way on their life. Are you ready? Yes! yes. Let's go, let's play, let's play a true false game. The first question. The capital of New Zealand is Wellington. The capital of New Zealand is Wellington. Is it true? True. Excellent, true. good job. Next question. The capital of the USA is Washington. The capital of the USA, United States of America, is Washington. Yes, it's true. We are sad. Is it false? No, no it is. We are in Kapoetahtu. Today, let's talk about feedback. Feedback, what does it mean? Feed and back. Feedback, it means, it means to give somebody helpful or useful information to improve or develop somebody's study, maybe courses or etc. I've got three questions. Well, are you ready? Well, the first question. Have you ever got feedback from your peers, from your friends? Have you ever? Huh, Olya? Huh, Olya? Yes, I got feedback from my friends yesterday. It uh, makes me cool and uh, motivated. Motivated. Excellent. Good job. Second question. Have you ever got any feedback from your teacher? Uh -huh. Sebara? For example, yesterday I got feedback from my English teacher about my studies. Ah, you about your studies. Uh -huh, thank you. Well, very good. Uh, how do you feel yourself when you get the feedback? How do you feel yourself? Uh, Martin? Yeah, nice. When I got the feedback, I was angry. Ah, you were angry. But Martin, there is a difference between feedback and criticism. Feedback is a useful and helpful and good advice, but criticism? Thank you, During the quarantine, I had difficulty to get to or contact with my pupils who are preparing for the entrance exams. That's why I decided to create my own channel on YouTube. Since 2019, I have been creating my new videos related to the entrance exams, rules, grammar rules, or some preparation tests and upload them on the internet. And how we can use adjective and adverb? What's the difference between that? Let's talk about first of all adverb. Students don't need a perfect teacher. They need only life satisfied. Encouraging teachers. Only such kind of teachers can motivate people to come to schools with great enthusiasm and learn with eagerness. That's why inspiration on learning stands on the first place.